What is up guys, Sean here, and today let's talk about what the best camera of 2021 is. And it's not gonna be what you think. Okay, lights, camera, and action. First and foremost, if you're new to this channel, then thanks for stopping by. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe so you can get more videos like this one. And if you're returning because you're already subscribed, well then, thanks for coming back. When it comes to filmmaking and photography or even YouTubing, the number one question that I get asked is, which camera am I using? And it's interesting that it's perceived that in order to kick out quality content, you need to have a top grade camera or the latest and greatest. Well, my friends, that simply isn't true. Not anymore, at least. See, here's the thing, after 2017, cameras shifted in like a very big way. And I'm not just talking about DSLRs, I'm actually talking about the camera that you carry with you every single day. The one in your pocket, your phone. Before we get into all that though, I wanna take a moment to discuss the brands that are used by the most popular YouTubers. Gerald Undone recently kicked out an amazing compilation video where YouTubers discuss their YouTube setups. Also, I feel a bit left out. And they discussed everything from their lights, mics, and cameras. Specifically based on YouTubers who submitted a video to him, here's the top brands for cameras that were used. A whopping 29 choose to shoot on a Sony, five on a Canon, three on a Panasonic, one on Fuji, and leave it to MKBHD to, of course, shoot on a red. Now the point of this video is to explain how the best camera isn't a specific brand, but rather everything you use as a whole and how you use it. I do highly recommend that you check out Gerald Undone's video and you'll see what I mean. So the reason why you're here, what is the best camera? Well first let's talk about the subject matter. What are you filming? Is it going to be a vlog? Are you taking photos of some food? A talking head video? Interviews? Podcasts? A short film? Are you shooting a feature length film? Before you decide on a camera, it's a good idea to understand what the subject matter is and what it's going to be used for. Shooting an interview? Any DSLR after 2017 should suffice. I'd recommend something 4K capable, of course, um, which shouldn't be too hard to find. I'm sensing it. If you're not satisfied with such a broad response like what I just said, then I think you need to do some more digging into the creative aspect of filmmaking and photography. Like the setup, the shoot, lighting, audio, and of course, putting everything together in the edit. A photographer or a filmmaker isn't made by the gear that they carry but rather what they can do with the gear that they're carrying. Being a photographer or filmmaker is much more difficult than owning the latest camera for good visuals. It's problem solving, creating something out of nothing. Recently, Zack Snyder shot a short film entirely on an iPhone. I've heard people say that they're having a hard time recreating footage that looks like that. And again, it all goes down to the technique that was used by the filmmaker while using his iPhone for the footage not necessarily the camera. Now I do understand that using your phone for a filmmaking or photography does have its limitations, but it will also force you to learn workarounds like how to problem solve on a photography shoot or a filmmaking shoot. So what is the best camera for 2021? It's the one that you have on you to get the job done. Get creative, start shooting, and stop worrying about the latest Canon, Sony, or Nikon, or whatever camera it is that you're looking for. To achieve the look you want, learn more about the camera you already own, and the best way to learn is through trial and error. All right guys, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'm sorry if it was a bit clickbaity. So what is your go-to camera for your shoots and why? Sound off in the comments below, and I will see you guys in the next one. Go out, stop watching, start shooting. Bye, peace.